Palm Sunday marks the beginning of Holy Week, a time of deep meaning for Christians around the world. On this day, we remember the triumphal entry of Jesus into Jerusalem, riding on a donkey, while the crowd welcomed him with palm branches and acclamations of, Hosanna to the Son of David. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. On this Palm Sunday, as we remember the triumphal entry of Jesus into Jerusalem, we cannot help but be moved by the total dedication of our Savior. Let's imagine the scene. Jesus riding a humble donkey, surrounded by a crowd that cheers him with joy. His eyes reflect love and compassion as he observes each person around him, knowing what awaits him in the days to come. Amid the bustle of the crowd and the fresh aroma of palms waved in the air, Jesus carries in his heart the burden of the suffering that he will soon face on the cross. However, his love for us is so great that he does not back down or lose heart. With courage and determination, he advances toward his ultimate destiny, willing to sacrifice his life for our redemption. This event symbolizes the humility and greatness of Jesus. Despite his divine power, he chose to enter the city not on a war horse, but on a humble donkey, thus showing his meekness and desire to serve. The crowd, which received him with joy and praise, also represented the expectations and hopes of the people of Israel towards their Messiah, who would bring liberation and the establishment of the kingdom of God. However, we know that this same crowd that cheered him with joy would in a few days turn against him, shouting, Crucify him! So this day, Palm Sunday, reminds us of the fickle and changing nature of humanity, but also teaches us about Jesus' unwavering faithfulness to his divine mission, even in the midst of suffering and betrayal. As we contemplate this scene, we cannot help but feel deeply moved by the unconditional love of Jesus. He not only walked to the cross for those who hailed him at the time, but also for each of those who did not, and even more so, for each of us, down through the centuries. His sacrifice reminds us that no matter how dark our days are, or how overwhelming our trials feel, we can always find hope and comfort in his undying love. On this Palm Sunday, let us reflect on the meaning of Jesus' entry into Jerusalem. May it inspire us to welcome him into our own lives with humility and gratitude, recognizing his lordship and his unconditional love for each of us. May this day prepare us to accompany him on his path to the cross and celebrate his final victory over sin and death at Easter. May this Palm Sunday inspire us to renew our commitment to Jesus, to follow him courageously and to love him with all our being. May his example of humility, sacrifice, and love guide us on our own journey of faith, and may we experience the fullness of his grace and redemption in our lives. Before praying I kindly ask you, please consider subscribing, now let us pray. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Beloved Jesus, on this Palm Sunday, we receive you into our lives with joy and gratitude. We acclaim you as our Lord and Savior. And we offer you our hearts as your home. So that you dwell in us every day. Help us follow your example of humility and service. And give us strength to remain faithful to you in the middle of our trials. And to face the temptations of life with courage and righteousness. May our fears never be greater than our love for you. May our needs never be above that love that you have taught us for one another just as you have loved us so that we become a living example of your compassion and of charity for humanity. May this Easter days be a time of spiritual renewal for us to get closer to you and your teachings and to become a permanent reminder of that immense love you have for us so that we may walk with you at all times remembering your passion death and resurrection, as an example of your unbreakable love, of integrity, of humility, and so, to experience the fullness of your salvation in our lives. Thank you Jesus. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.